Hey guys, um, this is Felicia, and today I'm going to talk to you about Galagos. This is my greater Galago. His name is Zumi. Say hi, Zumi. Um, he's about a year old, and um, there are two different types of species of Galagos. There's the greater Galago and the lesser Galago, and he is the greater Galago. The lesser Galagos are smaller, and they have larger eyes. Um, I'm just going to kind of let him run around while I talk. Um, they're both insectivores, and they love eating fruits and vegetables. I feed him a main diet of um, insure crickets, superworms. Um, I kind of try to lay off the mealworms because they are more fat than anything. Um, he loves apriums. You can get them at uh, Sam's Club or I think Walmart too. Um, he likes the grapes with seeds. Uh, peaches, pears, plums, basically anything. Any kind of fruit. Apple juice. He likes mac and cheese too. Um, one thing that you cannot feed them is pork. Uh, primates cannot digest pork products. So whatever you do, don't feed them pork. Um, what else? Uh, he does have a diaper on. And um, I'll give you the website below on where to order them because this lady is really great. Uh, she's never made bush baby diapers, so we were the first ones to <laughs> test her out on it. And she's done really well, actually. And um, he is neutered. Um, you don't have to get him neutered, but... They do have a tendency to be a little more aggressive, the males do, but he is just a sweetheart. Um, uh, the reason why I wear, he wears a diaper is because the males urinate on their hands and <laughs> wipe it on things, on furniture, on people, on your face. I've had this happen. Uh, they do it to uh, show ter uh, mark their territory, so he wears a diaper because <laughs> um, I've had that happen one too many times. They're very active at night and they're... Sorry about that. They're very affectionate. Um, one thing that is really cool about him is if you scratch him a certain way, let me see if I can get him to do it. He'll raise his arm up. Come here, Zumi. Let go of my finger. Oh, there you go. <laughs> He's very, very sweet. They have uh, front, their front teeth stick out like straight and they scrape you. And that's their, they're not being mean or anything. Whenever he bites like that, he's being affectionate. So, um, he's really hyper and playful right now because it's like 11 o'clock at night. Um, but yeah, he, they're really fun to care for, but they definitely are a handful. Because if you don't spend time with him, he does get depressed, so, um, you definitely have to make sure to spend time with him. I keep him on a leash, usually, and I'll, like, I'll take him outside at night and play with him and everything. But he's definitely a little handful. He gets along, along very well with the, uh, dogs that we have, and he wants to play with our marmoset that we have, but she just kind of grabs his face and he doesn't really like that. So, um, come here, baby. Um, so yeah, they're really, they're really great with kids. I know, like, he'll kind of, like, nibble on me a little bit harder than anyone else, and, um, I notice, like, whenever he, a kid is holding him or something, he doesn't nibble, he just licks them. <laughs> but he definitely nibbles on me. But um, yeah, uh, leave a comment below if you have any questions. Feel, I'll feel, uh, feel more than free to comment on anything. I don't consider anything a stupid question. So um, I'll answer any questions that you have. Just comment below. Alright, <laughs> bye you guys. Say bye, Zoom.